check these things out. They're friggin' sweet. As true fashion for this channel, nothing is prepared. Everything is off the top of my head as I think of it. So it could be pretty unhinged and it could make no sense at all. But today I wanted to talk about the Sue Ray um, Nightwalkers. Is that what they're called? Fuck, see, I don't even know what they're called. This is how, this is how unprepared I am. Yeah, they are called the Sue Ray Nightwalkers. <laughs> I got these off their Kickstarter, um, and I'll talk first about the buying process. Super easy with them. It got shipped in no time. They actually sent me um, two sets of these lenses, so I got four lenses, and then got a very kind phone call saying, can you please return that? We sent it to you by accident, so I will be doing that. I haven't done it yet, it's been a little while. <laughs> they probably think I stole it. These lenses um, are awesome. These lenses are $339 US, something like that. I got a the two-pack, a uh, 16 millimeter T1.2, and then a 75 millimeter T1.2 as well. I've been looking for some budget cine lenses for my FX30 for a little while, and I kept seeing these ones come up. There's some hype around them. The hype died down. Maybe it's still up. I just haven't seen much about them. I decided to pull the trigger, um, and I've been testing them for a little while now um, on some shoots, um, some stuff that I'm not allowed to release yet because it's client work. And so today I thought I would go around the beautiful city of Vancouver and it's somewhat light, cloudy, hazy day, I don't know what to call it, but and test these out in um, a number of different situations. We'll be using an ND filter so I can bring it right down to that 1.2 uh, aperture. And based on what you see, you can decide if you want to get this yourself for a very um, budget friendly option. And so far what I've seen from them, I've actually really enjoyed. Yeah, this is completely, um, again, at, oh God, there's some screws coming out of this table. Um, as I was saying, this there's no planning to this. We're we're not sponsored by this company. We didn't get given these. I bought these. I don't care for sponsorships. I am just having fun talking about random stuff and not planning it out very well. Realness, I guess. I don't know. Open my eyes, I slept through the day Slept through the day Feeling uneasy, I push it away Push it away Last night was fun, don't feel like today Feel like today Let's do it again, let's go on a date Cause tonight I'm gonna take you out And live the dream That we've been talking about So we can down And spend the ball on those Celebrating how some fun tonight I wanna show you how to love this things in life So raise your toes for all the good times that we'll have It'll be like the movies, be like the movies Rich people dreaming Rich people dreaming Rich people dreaming Nice signs going past Okay Let's talk about these things. First, I should make sure my volume's on. Perfect. So, I just got back, I looked at some of the footage, color graded some of it. I'm a little sweaty. Oh, first of all, these things are sweet. I got these all the time as a kid. I haven't had them in a while. So, sugar rush. These things are sweet. <laughs> um. I actually did expect a lot because I have watched some reviews of these beforehand. Um, I did not expect this build quality. Like when you buy a $350, I guess USD um, in Canada, I don't know what that is, $450, you don't expect build quality like this. This is incredible. I don't have data behind these. I don't know at what aperture it's the cleanest and the sharpest. I, I go based off of feeling and what I see. Um, that's why I use vintage lenses a lot. I love that feeling. It's an organic, raw feeling. That's, it's a little bit hard to describe. And this is so close to having that. 
Maybe it's the imperfections, that's that's what it is. If I were to only get one of these lenses, out of the 75 and 16 um, kit that they have, I would, I use a 16 way more. The 75 is like nice, it's a nice focal length, you can get really close on things. Yeah, I, this is all based off of a feeling for me, and um, I get a good one with these things. I, I really like these lenses. I'm going to be sure to get low light of this um, in this video as well, just because uh, with the 1.2, um, that's going to let in a lot of light, and yeah, we're going to try that out before I end this. completely these things get a thumbs up for me uh, I really like them they're a lot of fun they're cheap and the build quality is incredible absolutely incredible that's all <laughs>